Okay, in this video, I'm, I'm going to introduce the first chapter in the book Fundamental Applied Mathematics on Vectors. And very briefly, I'm going to try and motivate you for studying vectors. So, the first thing is that vectors are a very simple concept, and they essentially involve drawing lines on a page at a certain length and drawing angles, drawing them with respect to certain things by a certain angle. That's, that's what a vector might look like. I'm not going to go into any more detail in, in, in that respect. However, by using vectors, you're able to do lots of things. And in the Applied Maths course, you have, you have, there are, are chapters on things like projectiles, on collisions, on relative velocity, and so on. And every single one of these things here, and more, are all analysed using vectors. So vectors is the only chapter, essentially, in the book, that, or on the course, or in applied maths, that if you don't have it done, you can't really do anything else. So, for example, if you didn't do projectiles, that wouldn't stop you doing collisions. And if you didn't do collisions, it wouldn't stop you doing relative velocity. However, if you didn't do vectors, you wouldn't be able to do any of those. So vectors are the fundamental, in my opinion, the fundamental... Uh, skill you need, especially if you're leaving Sir Applied Maths course. If you can't do vectors, you're not really at, uh, at anything. But the important thing here is, the best part is that vectors to, uh, to actually analyse and use are actually very simple. They're, like I said, just drawing lines on a page and drawing them in, in certain directions. So the most complicated diagram you may, might see might look like, it might look something like this. Just bear with me for a moment. That is, I would imagine, the most complicated diagram you will see when you're dealing with vectors. Now, while I'm not expecting that you know what that means, I'd hope that, having looked at it, you'd say, well, that doesn't seem too difficult to draw or write out. And it's using things like I've seen before, adding vectors. You've seen sine and cosine before. You've seen your x and y axis making your xy plane before. So there are things that aren't too new, so they should be able to be grasped. So like I said, vectors are the fundamental chapter for your applied mathematics course. They're not too difficult, so uh, let's get stuck in. Thanks for watching. Please pass it on to your friends and subscribe to my channel.